multiplying binomials problem type 1. These are simple directions for relatively simple problems. It just says to multiply x minus 4 times the quantity x plus 6. This is where we use the FOIL method. Okay, whoops, F-O-I-L. And we want to really understand what each of those means. F-O-I-L. This is first, outer, inner, and last. What the heck? What, what does that mean? Well, let's take a look. First. The first means the very first terms of each parenthesis. Okay? So we're going to multiply each of those together. So that's the first. So for our f, we get x squared. Now, let's look at outer. The outer means that we're going to multiply the outer two things in the parentheses. Okay, that's our outer, x times a positive 6. So our outer gives a positive 6x. Okay, now let's look at the inner. The inner means that we're going to multiply the two innermost or the closest things together. That's a negative 4 times x. So our inner gives a negative 4x. And then our last, of course, is the only thing we have left. The last two thi the last things of each parentheses. That's a negative 4 times a positive 6. So for our last, we get a negative 24. Now, the interesting thing about these problems is almost always our outer and our inner combine. Notice that we have a positive 6x and a negative 4x. Those are like terms, so those go together. So our final answer would look like this. It would be x squared, and then here those combine to be a positive 2x, and then minus 24. And that's it. Our answer is complete. Okay, let's take a look at uh, another quick example. Here we've got the quantity u plus 5 times the quantity u minus 1. So our first looks like a u squared. Our outer looks like a negative 1u. Our inner is a 5u. And our last gives negative 5. Again, we have like terms, so our final answer is going to be a u squared plus 4u minus 5. And that's it. Whoops.